Captain's Log Supplemental here at Doug Drexler's house. <laughs> I do Captain's Logs for my for our channel. Um, just doing some video, just taking a break. We're doing an interview outside with Doug, getting some great footage. Samuel's here too, Commander Cocking. So, just giving you guys a little teaser of what's coming up. So a, a little warning of what's coming up. A warning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, guys, Don't you have something better to do. <laughs> probably do, probably do. We got a lot to do today, so he's just the first stop on our grand tour today. I'm the first stop on the grand tour today. The most important stop, some would say. I'm not making any big claims. <laughs> anyway, guys, see you soon, and look forward to this interview because it's a good one. Oh, I hope I hope you're right. Make <laughs> me look smart in the edit. Oh, we're not that good. <laughs> Anytime you want. Wow. He says we'll be waiting with open arms. And I actually went right out to LA. And uh, there were no sets yet. Um, so we're just leaving Doug Drexler's place. Get the hell out of here. I've had it with you guys. Pushy, pushy, pushy. Push. It's a push, push, push business. Love you, a push, push, push business. Push, 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 push. You're such a curmudgeon. I'll see you monkeys later. All right. Have a good trip. Okay. It's great. It was great to see you. 3D. Exactly. In 3D. Coming at you in 3D. And smell a vision. <laughs> Bye, Doug. See you later. Hey guys, back at Airy Studios, and we got a nice Constitution class ship here. First of its line, with the bigger bridge, the spikes on the bizarre collectors, oversized deflector dish. And if you pan around here, it's got a nice little touch on the back for the first of the class. Right there with the shuttle bay, it says Utopia Planitia Shipyards. So that's a nice little added touch that I really appreciate in something like this. This has got a fantastic paint job. I love the 350 scale ships. This isn't as good as mine, of course. This one doesn't light up. Um, and, you know, it's, it's an older model, but Paint job's fantastic, looks great, and I absolutely love any 350 ships. So, this chance to show you one, I'll take it. Anyway, guys, lots more to do today, so let's get to it. On Star Trek, and he has something saved away. Uh, we'll take it on consignment, we'll do the research on the item, make sure it was actually screen used or production made, and then uh, we'll go ahead and put it up for auction. Uh, how many items do you think you've sold? Or is it just Star Trek related? Uh, Star Trek related items, probably around, I would say, 800. Um, we've done almost 10 Star Trek auctions now, so. There's still a, how much, well, how much of a, of a, of a interest, how much of a drive to buy these items is there? There's actually a lot of drive. Um, Star Trek is uh, one of those franchises that the fans are really rabid about. You know, they can't get enough of. So guys, just continuing day four of our trip, uh, Captain's Log, back with Alec Peters, looking at some of his costumes and stuff. Gonna do some short, nice little short videos for you guys to enjoy so lots lots going on today like i said hope you guys are enjoying this quick little video hi alec peters from star trek props.com here and i'm here with my captain kirk costume which was from star trek the motion picture it's actually screen used and it was the one he used in the very last scene when they come back from vidra and they're standing on the bridge it is a jumpsuit with a built-in booties uh it's got the, obviously the the, the uh, star trek so guys, kind of excited. This is Captain Kirk's uniform from Star Trek V. Um, I'm excited to be holding this. It's got the pants, the belt is there. The sweater, I used to have a tactical sweater like this uh, when I was younger. I used to pretend that it was a Starfleet uniform. So this is awesome that this was worn by William Shatner. I just wanted to share that with you guys. So guys, we've been doing a lot of cool stuff today. He's been doing some awesome film work oh, for you guys. You. Lot and cool. also transferring as well. You gotta keep everything continuously transferring. And charging. Yes. <laughs> That's important. But lots going on, and we're giving you a sneak peek of all that in this captain's log, so. We're in the thick of it right now. We're doing it, we're, we're and we're prepping some other stuff. Because these guys are amazing. Like, seriously, they are huge Trek fans. Oh. We're huge Trek fans. And they obviously like our show and like, like our content. They want to help you guys make great content. Or, well, no. That doesn't make sense. They want to help us make great content for you. So you so yeah, so there's a great collection and helping us put it out so we can do videos on them. Um, and you know what? This this is like the second Captain's Log that you're on. Like you're actually on the Captain's but Log. We didn't introduce it as the Captain's Log though. Well, it's Captain's Log supplemental. Oh. Uh, Captain's Log. Uh, Commander's Log. Uh, anyway. 
it's cool to see us together. I'm, I'm, I've been having a great time hanging out with you. Yeah, me too. And we still got, what, like 10 days to go? Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah but that's going to go quick, just like LA did. Like, this is our last full day in LA, so. It's been a blast, though. Yeah. So much trek. This is probably the most trek we're going to have because it's so diverse. I think mean, Taekwondo yeah. will be like TOS Nirvana, you know? <laughs> yeah. This is the most trek. And it's just, yeah. again, these guys are so great and so welcoming. And so, I mean, that, just look at that view. And, and they've moved everything and helped us look at everything. And we've got some amazing. Um, you see that display right there? There's some mm -hmm. stuff in that, mm -hmm. and next to it, we've mm -hmm. done some full, not reviews, but lookouts, which are longer, really cool. It was fun to film, you guys are gonna love it. And just for us, we've done some of this stuff before, but we've got screen stuff here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. Yeah. Um, so, stay tuned. Yeah. Bye, guys. Bye. Yeah, it's just saying goodbye to Axonar Studios. See you. Bye, guys. And I'm still filming. I'm still doing little colorways. Yeah, we're still Last doing stuff. Minute, guys. Yeah, but. Part of the captain's log, just going, giving you guys a behind the scenes what's going on. We're done here for the day. Done here for LA. Done here for until we come back to California. So. I'm going to film you filming. Well, I, my phone's going to die in a second. So. Well, it's been a great trip, guys. Thanks so much. So many videos. I'm gonna keep going, I'm gonna be 60. Best guess is a cool place. I love going there. Hi guys. Hi John. <laughs> Don't film my gut. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. Film mine. I did for a fact that was good me. It was. That was good me. And not, uh, not okay guys, that's it for the captain's log today. A bunch of little pieces of bits and things that you've seen, uh, teasers of what we've done and what we haven't done, and well, what we've done, I guess. But yeah, anyway, um, I just wanted you guys to see those and get a kind of a feel for what's going on here in LA. This is our last night. We're just packing up, getting our stuff ready. We have to leave tomorrow, be at the airport by noon. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, there will be better captain's logs once I can kind of reveal everything we've done when we get back. But until then, you just get a sneak peek. So we'll see you soon. Tomorrow it's off to Denver. Hi ho, hi ho, it's off to Denver we go to Denver Comic Con. Yes. So we'll see you there. Bye.